All right, guys, what's up? So we're gonna do a quick little video. Came up with the kind of MacGyver kind of idea. I wanted to get some of the line off my other reel that I've been using now that I switched over with all my Okuma gear. I didn't want to lose all that line on some of the reels. Um, so I did have these, these rod holders lying around. As you can tell, I got these on Amazon. So you can fish like the piers and stuff. Um, it's a clamp on rod holder. Got the rod set up in it already. I got the reel. It's lined up. It's actually connected over to my brand new Okuma PCH inshore rod. As you can see, and my, my Okuma Komodo. Okay. So pretty much, I'm going to use this rod in the rod holder here, and I set the drag pretty pretty fair, you know. Um, and I'm going to just reel off that other rod to get all the line off of it so you can tie any any kind of knot you know um on your spool the arbor knot a bunch of different, different knots but uh i'm gonna clip this camera on here somewhere and see if we can make this work you know all right so i'm just gonna just reel this up Not even halfway done yet. This is tough, tough work. You guys can see, so my flash is out. Let's see, almost there, about three quarters of the way. We're gonna keep going. Really hard work. Right, guys, I don't know if you can see, but I pretty much took all that line off on my other reel down to the tape just by doing that. Okay, so there it is old reel, no line, new reel, new Komodo full line looks like it could use a little more but it's a simple way to do this just a simple rod holder from amazon it's a few bucks put in the rod holder all right guys here we are unfortunately my my battery died on my gopro and i was filming that the end of that video so i'm out here today it's a little brighter a little more daylight so i can show you um all this stuff but uh pretty much this is the the rod holder you can get them on amazon they're pretty cheap 20 bucks or something like that for two of them um i'll put the link in there in the video for that but i also had found an extra rod holder that i had in my uh, in my little office there and it was actually it was meant for a kayak um that i had never got to use it but i'm gonna make some use of it now it's, this is it right here it's actually this one is made by real blazer and uh just kind of drilled it in i cut the rod here like i would when i spool another reel and uh just pretty much put in the rod holder the rod does all the you know keep tension on it and all that you want to set your drag pretty tight so when you do tie that braid onto the next spool every next reel and transfer it over all you got to do is reel it in so this is another option or you can do use this option right here which is what i had in the video okay so super simple way to transfer line from one reel to the next hopefully that helps you guys and uh until next time you guys keep watching the videos i got more stuff coming we're approaching sturgeon season now that's coming up um some surf fishing in the spring surf perch some crab snaring all kinds of stuff and of course we're gonna try to get a sturgeon from shore this year so 
yeah, you guys stay safe. Happy holidays and hope you guys enjoy this video. Until next time, see you in the water. Make sure you hit that, that subscribe button. You just like it, comment, hit that notification bell, and uh, we'll see you soon. All right, later.